People of the verse, hello and welcome to the channel, it's the Radicator, and in this video we are going to talk about what's coming up in Star Citizen of 2021, and especially I want to talk about the possibility of a construction starship or a construction vehicle coming up in Star Citizen of 3, um, probably uh, quarter 3 2021. Now here's why I think that this is happening, if we have a look at the roadmap in Star Citizen Alpha, uh, Star Citizen, I keep saying Alpha, we don't even know if it's going to be Alpha, probably, right? In Star Citizen Quarter 3 2021, we can see that there is in, um, so where is it located? It's located in Modular, in the Modular tab, you can see there is a, uh, an item called Small Home Outpost, and this one is uh, going to be worked on for 28 weeks, so that's going to be a, a long time. Obviously, obviously, they've already started working on that because we've seen the work in Inside Star Citizen. Work is, um, as you can see, starting already in January and scheduled to finish by July 2021, meaning that here we are aiming at a release window for the end of September 2021. And it says a small home for players to leave and shelter. They consist of a central hub and a few optional internal and external modules. They provide the basic necessities to support a small group of people for an infinite amount of time. Obviously, for this to happen, we need to have iCash, but by then, uh, iCash is scheduled to be released by the end of quarter to 2021. If not, then it will be released by quarter 3, 2021 but it is definitely expected to be released by them and if that's not gonna happen it will be by the end of the year right because Chris says that uh, he definitely believes that at least iCache or server meshing if not both will be released in 2021 but you know we all know that we should always take his words with a grain of salt right anyway so how do we build those houses how do those small homes get to the verse, right? That is the big question. We all know that there is a ship that is going to be dedicated to that, and that ship is the Pioneer. Now, the problem with the Pioneer is that it is a very large ship, and large ships, by definition, take a lot of time to make. I mean, think of the C2 Hercules, which has been taken under work for almost, uh, for almost a year now, and I'll think of, uh, for example, the Karak, which also took a very long time. We're talking about large ships like that. If we even have a look at some of the ships here that are going to work, we talk about the Polaris, for example, the Polaris, which is hopefully going to be released by the end of 2021. The Polaris here says that it's going to take 23 weeks to finish the Polaris. That is also a long time. So that's why I don't believe that the Pioneer will be one of the ships. Now, what are we looking at here? We are looking at some uh, ships that are going to be unannounced. Now, there is indeed, there is indeed an unannounced ship over here uh, that is going to take 26 weeks. The work is going to start in April and is going to end in October 2021. Now, that's not going to match the release window of Q3, Q3 2021, which is why I don't think that this is necessarily going to be the ship that will be uh, building those outposts. But again, we know that uh, there, there are going to be extra outposts in the future uh, and larger ones as well. So it could be the Pioneer. But uh, but uh, the Pioneer is scheduled to be building uh, outposts that are going to be larger than the small homes that we're talking about. The Pioneer is supposed to be building some of the outposts that we already have in the verse. The outposts, you know, those mining outposts, those research outposts those farms these are not the small homes that we will be getting in quarter three 2021 so that's why the pioneer to build those small homes in my opinion is a little bit overkill and so this is why i think that we need another uh, ship that perhaps is going to be uh, is going to be a little bit smaller and more fitting to build those ships now we have uh it turns out that there is an unannounced vehicle here. It's not a uh, it's not a ship here. It's a vehicle that is also uh, going to be released uh, in quarter three 2021, matching the release mode of uh, the um, matching the release mode of uh, the homes. And here it says that it's going to take 24 weeks to um, to build this unannounced vehicle, which is uh, going to get some art and design at the same time. No engineering though, so it could be not it, but I was thinking that maybe instead of having a construction starship 
for the small homes, maybe we could just have a construction vehicle, you know, a vehicle that would, that would have uh, the materials inside, you know, maybe it could be transported by a ship, such as a C2 Hercules, for example, drop that vehicle with a C2 Hercules, go to the place where you want to build that small home, not an outpost, the small home, and then that ground vehicle is going to be uh, making that, uh, that, that, that that small home here. So this is what I believe this unannounced vehicle is here starting the work has already started is unannounced and it is going to be released also also finished by july 2021 which is going to also match that time window for the small homes which will be released in quarter three 2021 so there we have it guys this is pure speculation of course it's a bet but i believe that CIG is working on a brand new vehicle that is going to complement the Pioneer and will uh, be uh, used for not base build, base building, but home building. And with this, they are going to test the technology and the mechanisms for the Pioneer, which will eventually come in in 2022 when we will be building the outpost that we see in the verse right now. Speaking of unannounced ship, though, there it, there are a couple of interesting other ones here. There's a there's one that needs four weeks of content in, in Q1 2021. I bet this is the 400i, uh, but we'll see, right? Uh, there's that other big one here, 26 weeks by uh, Q4 2021. Uh, quite a few interesting ones indeed right and there's another one here from the US team which these are which needs some uh, tech content but only uh, three weeks this one also uh, will be done very quickly but it's still unannounced probably going to be a straight to released uh, vehicle here uh, but at the same time it needs tech content so that's that's also uh, something that, that that is intriguing right anyway guys what do you guys think about uh, those ships here uh, those unannounced vehicles in the roadmap do you also think that we are going to have a dedicated builder or, or, or base building vehicle coming up this year or at least this year next year right when we are going to have the player homes please let me know in the comments down below and sorry about the noise my baby girl is always with me when i'm making videos <laughs> all right guys if you like this kind of content you want to see more daily videos about star citizen you know what to do the like and the subscribe buttons are down there uh, if you want to support the channel furthermore the link to the patreon or the join button is also here any help over there is greatly appreciated i'll see you guys tomorrow for more star citizen content this is the eradicator i'll see you guys later